glass boy. He was shattered into a, a million pieces, transformed into something new. What? What are you doing here? How did you get in here? You, you always said your door was open to me. You, you left your door open. This is not a good time. No, there never is a good time, is it? Here, I found these when I took a shortcut across the cemetery. I thought you might like them. Something they might cheer you up. It's been a very long day. Don't you have somebody else to stop? Oh. Regrettably, no. But it did happen, didn't it? Just as I said it would. I don't want to talk about it. Tell me about it. I must know. I don't need your consoling. I understand. But I must know how this symphony of storms played out. Just go. I need to be alone. Oh. One is always a loneliest number. Taken that so forcibly from you. I'm sorry you had to see all that again. I promise I was, I was gentle and stayed on the surface, more or less. <laughs> but I needed to know exactly what occurred. How dare you! You had no right! And whatever you saw was none of your business! And, and why did you send me there? Why did you have me send him there? He, she, they were innocent people. He just, he's a, they are monsters. I had both the right and the urgency. Now, while I would never diminish your pain, trust me when I tell you I've seen more hurt, more pain, more suffering in my entire life that you have in this one little moment. This uh, talent is nothing but a constant nightmare of screams. Only death will silence the hammering of nails in my head. I'm sorry, I guess, but you still had no right. I don't even know what I mean. I'm not even sure I fully understand what we're talking about. Oh, no fretting. Yes, the pain is unavoidable, but so is the love and the beauty and the pleasure that accompany it. Are you a monster too? Like them? Monsters. What a grand statement. It was going to happen regardless. 
We just helped it along. What do you mean regardless? But you said... Yes, I know what I said. But it is their way. It is what they must do to survive. And monsters. The monsters, they're not all as... What's the word? Evil. Not all like him. His sire, right? I know, I know. It's hard for you to believe under all these circumstances, under everything that you've seen. But you must trust me. How does that phrase go? Without trust, words, words are, are nothing but a hollow gong or a hollow wooden gong. But with trust, words become life itself. What? Huh? God, talking to you gives me such a headache. I don't care anymore. I don't want to know anymore. I just need to... He can be stopped. We have waited long enough. But why me? Why this? Why are you here? I can't lose anymore. Even though I did what I did, I... I have nothing more to give. Listen. We don't have a choice in this. I don't have, certainly have a choice in this. When I, when I left, when I ran from my cherub's arms, when I, I, I slept, I saw, after seeing, was that creature, was that creature that wraps himself in the blanket of the church, what, what he did to my whole family, what he did to my entire family. After seeing what I saw, I just, I just ran. I, I had to get out of there before everything was gone, before, before the world turned, turned in on itself, before I was no m more. But you, oh, you, your pain, your anger, cut across the air like a, a blade. I was drawn to it like a moth to a car fire, something like that. Your di the, the thick black smoke of your despair was, was impossible to ignore. I couldn't escape it. That is when I knew that is when I knew that you needed me as much as I needed you. As that our pain, our suffering was connected to that creature. We must work together on this. Ugh. This is it's the one thing he would never expect we would do. You know, I never ever went to this church. Or any church. I didn't think it would lead to anything like this. But my parents insisted on a baptism. I finally gave in because I thought... I thought... You don't blame your parents, do you? For all this, say a sheep like all the rest. How can I? Even if I did, I don't know where they are. They disappeared at the same time it happened. I haven't seen them since. They're probably dead too. Or... Oh, I, I pray that is not the case. Can, can you sense something? Maybe you can feel something. No, no, I, I, I'm i sorry. I, I cannot. I, I often have to tune so much of it out or... I'd end up in a padded cell again. I'm sorry. How could I expect... But if he's been doing this for as long as you've said, to people, to children, to my... We have to. We can, and we will. Remember, remember that little piece of literature that has, has every man such a, a flurry that the monster craves only the blood of the young 
and given his preference, he will destroy the mature trees and feed only on the saplings. So wind, yes, so wind tells me that it is, it is these saplings that will be his undoing. And apparently I am the key to his power. Against the wind, he tries to resist, but he has no strength there. Oh, the, the warm, sweet nectar of, of these, these saplings, it controls him. He, he's like a, 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 what's that word? Junkies. I've been around enough, even experienced it a little myself. I know what junkies do. They live from one hit to the next, one feed to the other. Their habit will eventually kill them, kill others, but they can't stop. He will do anything to break you down, especially if he finds out what we are doing. He still believes he has a divine to do so. I, I don't know if I can. After what he did, do you have any idea what I had to do? Had to endure? Had to... I can barely stand working for it. His grace through the church's shelters. Do not ask me to go into that church of death. I won't, dear. But you need to stay focused. I know you can. I know for a fact that you will do whatever is necessary. How fucking dare you? You said you stayed on the surface. What did you see? Oh, I was, I was just a water bubble skimming across the surface. But there were some very dark images. It was, they bubbled up. Just the shut up! Just shut up! Threatening me makes about as much sense as trying to catch a shadow. It's not going to bring him back. It's, it's not going to change facts. It's, oh, it's certainly not going to stop the bishop from doing exactly as he pleases, as he has always done. How does that saying go? Time is a wasted. But it was. He. T I had to. I just said. I know. I know, dear. Now look at me. There is something, something distasteful that you must do. Something else. God, I'm afraid to ask what that is. It's a young bird. It's a young bird that left the nest, that, that shattered piece of glass. That put a few shards together and cut deep tonight. That vampire priest. Yes. They are both going to be stronger now. I know my love is still in that church. He's proven that by sending out the priest, by changing the priest. How do you know this? Can you do that mind thing with them? Oh, no, no, no. But I do sense something. Their minds are like radios in between stations turned almost all the way down. I can hear echoes, voices, music even, but oh, silence. Glorious silence. Being with him was like living and loving in the eye of the hurricane. But, oh, they're going to emerge soon, and there are going to be no more head of this convoluted games than we are. Oh, it's, we cannot, we must not let them be found, especially after that blood that was so casually spilt. We must, no, you must keep watching them. You need to keep an eye on them. What? Well, what do I do with them? You're not serious. 
Now that I think of it, you're going to have to do a lot more than just watch. You're going to have to build them a, a, a nest, a new nest, or yes, a birdhouse. No, yes. no, no, I can't. I won't. No. Do you see any other option in the rearview mirror? Objects are always larger than they appear. I can't believe you're saying this. I, I don't like this. Not, not one. You do know what would happen to all of our plans if the birds are allowed to fly around untethered. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> Excellent. I'm glad we understand each other. And remember, no matter what, Sean is, is not to know that I am here. If he if he finds out, that would put him and all of us in mortal danger. <laughs> Unfortunately, the pieces of this chess game have all gotten hurly burly. The bishop has much more power than he should. He's moving on all the wrong squares. The king and queen, no, oh, they don't dance anymore. And the knight, hmm, he's asleep, unaware of his power. Hmm. Well, it's time for a new game, a new round, and it starts immediately. Immediately? You mean tonight? Does this have to be done tonight? After what I saw? After what that creature did tonight? Oh, shit. If they're out in the open, wandering around, doing as they please. It won't be long until. His grace finds out. Remember what I've told you. You need to be strong through this. I know you can, but our opponent is very cunning, and very smart, and evil. Yes, well, if the shoe fits, or is it? I'm waiting, waiting for the other shoe to drop. I never remember that one. It's something about shoes. I'm sure of it. Either way, I will find you as I always have. And everything must be done tonight before the new moon rises. I expected that. Expected what? Shh. Well now, it's nice to finally meet you. I must say you're much cuter in person. Get your dead hands off of me, you pale blood-sucking scum! Oh, such language. You better start saying something real pretty fast. I've been sensing your presence for some time. I must say I'm pretty intrigued. I have nothing to say to you. You and your little creep of a spawn are going to ruin everything. That's... She's the one that I ran into when I left the church. <sighs> Shit, you've been following me? 
that has been established. Let me just kill her and be done with it. I'm not afraid of you. Although you both stink of rot. Ugh, you're making me gag. That's the second time someone says I stink. Do I smell? You never said vampire smell. Don't listen to her. I hear a lot of name calling, but not a lot of talking. What are you waiting for? We need to shut her up. While I'm tempted, and still kind of hungry, I want to hear what she has to say. You've been following my son for some time. I assume you're working for him, his grace, my sire? Yes. I am working for that monster, for a good reason. But your little drama here with your brat is going to ruin all of my hard work. You seem to have it as a disadvantage. I'm sorry, madam, but your name is? Nice. You've known our stalker for two minutes and you ask her name. Shh. Merle. You can call me Merle. And I need to get you out of here. I know where we can get you out of sight. Someplace safe. Are you coming? We don't have a lot of time, and from where I stand, we don't have a choice. You're not seriously thinking of going with her. It'd be like going from one torture dungeon to another. Like jumping out of the frying pan into the fire. I don't think so. Listen, I know you're upset and angry with me. And, and yes, we're out of the, the dungeon, finally. But we've got nothing. I am no closer to knowing Justine's location than I was when I walked in there six months ago. We haven't a clue about this so-called prophecy that my sire clings to. We need to stay two steps ahead of him, and right now, we're not doing that very well. Think about this. A few weeks back, that church was cleared of everyone except yourself and a few skeletons. He left you to your own devices, to me. We literally waltzed out of that sanctuary unmolested. He left you to me. He expected you to be eaten, to die. Now, I don't think he thought I would turn you, but that doesn't matter. Either way, he found you expendable. This, my friend, has been a setup. Hey, you coming or not? This is a one time offer. You'll be staying upstairs. You're a prick of a sire. He's only ten. I'm so sorry. Stop! Don't you dare even try to apologize. It's an insult coming from your kind. Especially you. 
with that monster's putrid blood in your veins. You even talk a little like him. I am nothing like him. Oh, really? What did you and your little boy here have for lunch today? Sean, this, this is wrong. I know. I feel it too. But hang on a little longer. Wrong or not, we need to find out how she's involved. Why are we here? Why would you put, as you would say, creatures like us, knowing full well what we are, in a space like this, in, in a holy place like this? I cannot begin to fathom your motivation. The easy response is, I have no other space. My true reason? that I find this a fitting and ironic punishment for you. Dying can be quick, but this, this is what death is. A death your kind doesn't know about. <laughs> we'll never know. Spend some time in here as a parent, and you will know why I do what I do. I promise you. I will stop him. Oh, I'm sure of that. I'm counting on it. Don't touch or move anything. You just stay in this room from dawn to dusk. Nighttime, you're on your own. I don't want to see you or your ankle biter here anywhere else in this house. Got it? Yes. I understand. Yeah. Now I have to go to work. Believe me, I don't want you in here either. But you need to keep a low profile, or else you're going to screw up all my plans. Oh, and you might want to stay away from those windows. The morning sun tends to make things a little toasty in here. 